Welcome to today's top five tweets of the week. Coming in at the number five spot, we have the pirate himself at Big Business, and he says, Stop rapping about losing your virginity in college dorms. You are 30 years old, nigga. He's referring to J. Cole, and in this video, J. Cole gets hit in the face by a cell phone. Yes, a fan threw a cell phone in his face. And actually, J. Cole was pretty professional. He picked up the phone, put it in his pocket, continued his verse. But we can all enjoy this video of J. Cole getting hit in the face. Boom! In the grill. And if that was an iPhone, we probably know that shit got broke because iPhones are made of ice. Then at the number four spot, we have Oh No Maria, whatever. She says, men want to be in a relationship with you, but they don't want to pay for your eyebrows, nails, hair, etc. By Brokies. It was actually quoted by Jams LDN and he says, Eyebrows grow for free, nails grow for free, hair grows for free. Knowing I'll never sponsor a broke bitch, priceless. This tweet is priceless. What an amazing comeback putting that girl in place because we don't want girls with those type of opinions. Thank you very much. Coming in at the number three spot, we have at Meek Mill and he says, Stop comparing Drake to me too. He don't write his own raps. That's why he ain't tweet my album because we found out. Now with this tweet, Meek Mill broke the internet. There was a crazy battle on Twitter. People saying Drake is fake. Fuck Drake. I knew this fool was whack. Other people defending Drake. Other people saying, oh, other artists have ghostwriters. And other people saying, as long as my favorite artist don't get a ghostwriter, I'm cool. At Go Go said, guys, I'm so sad I miss my boyfriend. And it was quoted by Lesbiana. He says, fuck your boyfriend. Meek throwing shots at Drake. It was just a great night on Twitter. I'll tell you that. If you weren't on Twitter that night, you still find out the next morning and the day after because people are still on that shit right now. Another funny one I found on my timeline was by Charlemagne the God. And he says, if Drake don't write his raps, I feel like I've been slandering him for absolutely no reason all these years. And all tweets were bad. Uh, Ishmael Pensuda says, this nigga telling us Drake don't write his shit like we don't know, left my fucking ass off. God wrote that for him. Drake a prophet. Now, I don't fuck with Drake after Coachella Fest, but that was a great tweet, and it deserves to be on this list. The funniest tweet of the night was from Ben Trash, and he says, Fun fact, Bill Cosby ghost wrote Rick Ross's verse on you and you and out. Now, that tweet was the best of the night. I don't care what anyone else tweeted, because this tweet was amazing. It was a shot of Bill Cosby, and if you don't know what that verse is, go check out that song, it's fire. Coming in at the number two spot is the Seattle Seahawks. Yes, the football team says, come on, at EA Madden NFL, what's the beast got to do to get a 99 trucking? Question mark. The reply from EA Madden NFL was just golden. They said, at Seahawks, one more of these probably could have helped. It's a picture of four plays and they're all straight running back dives, goal line formation because we know what happened in the Super Bowl. They probably should have run the ball. The rest is history. At the number one spot for this week's top tweet of the week is Jnumba910 and he says, Racist KKK member pissed on himself being approached by a Bloods gang member. Unless you were in an isolated island over the last week, you probably saw somewhere on the news or on your timeline that there was a rally for southern pride and racism I don't know there's a bunch of freaking confederate flags and nazi flags but the gang the bloods actually showed up to it and it started causing a bunch of commotion and all these people were scared we still got some amazing pictures and this is my favorite because there's this dude who thinks he's all racist he hates black people blah 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 and when he's confronted by one face to face he pisses on himself and that is what america is all about thank you for watching this week's top five tweets of the week Please comment below and do you agree or disagree with our list. And if you want to be featured in next week's episode of Top 5 Tweets of the Week, please add me on Twitter and I will find your tweet to see if it deserves to be in the top 5. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, like this video, share it with your friends, post it on your social media. And we'll see you next week. Thank you so much for watching.